Now Argamanis with a payoff pitch. Taken for a called strike three. Frozen with a fastball, and that retires the side to begin the ball game. Right fielder for the Spiders, batting 258. Sends a screamer over to third base, and that goes past the diving attempt of Thomas into the corner. Beal with some speed as he goes over to second base, and he's there with a stand-up double. See, Woodson delivers a sign to his hitter. The pitch. Ipsman sends a ground ball up the middle into center field for a base hit. Beal flies around third and scores. The throw onto third base is late and actually hits Mathis off the deflection. Hipsman goes over to second base. Spiders get their first run on the scoreboard with an RBI single from Johnny Hipsman. And an RBI and two doubles in that ball game. One, two pitches, a bouncer over to first base. It's picked up by Zimmerman. He steps on first for the out, but Mathis scores from third, and Hipsman advances to third. Like, McCausland really needs the pitch clock on him, though. Line shot over to left field, and that's how the Spiders want to start the fifth inning. Leadoff single for Jared Sprague Lott, and the third hit for Richmond this afternoon. The pitch is a line shot up the middle for Kluska. This will score a run. Bounces over to the center fielder as Sprague Lott scores. And advancing to third on the play is Conklin. RBI single for Mikey Kluska with his first hit of the ball game. And Aramak. The 1-1. Neff sends a charge over to right center field. Ball drifting downwards towards the warning track and it one hops the wall. Mathis with some speed. He rounds third and heads home. And he scores from first base. RBI double from Jason Neff. It is 10-5 here in the fifth inning with St. Joseph's in front. Fifth. The 1-1 pitch. Here's a blast out to center field. Long run for Wall. Over to the wall. That is over the wall and gone. Solo home run for Jordan Jaffe to lead off the sixth inning. Makes it 14 to six with the Hawks on top. But a good swing from Jordan Jaffe for his second home run of the year. The three two on the way. And this is a fly ball over to left field. Long run for Callahan towards the line and it's over the wall and gone. Three run homer for Johnny Hipsman. It's 17 to 10 here in the eighth inning. And Hipsman collects his fourth home run of the year. Collected today, he now has 16 on the season. The 1-1. One, one. There's a line shot over to left field. That's a base hit and rolling towards the wall. Rounding third and headed home is Jordan Jaffe. Elbury gets the stop sign at third base. RBI double for Jared Sprague Lott. In this inning, Johnny Hipsman with a three-run homer and the RBI double from Jared Sprague Lott. Now a line drive over to right field. It's over the second baseman's head for a base hit. Elbury scores. Sprague Lott rounds third and scores. It is now a four-run ball game. In the air to center, Alden Mathis going back. Ball's got some carry. Mathis at the wall. He's got it, right at the top of the wall. Alden Mathis, the catch of the game so far. Walked and scored in the seventh. Pop up, way up in the air on the infield. Sprague Lott going out to shallow right, and now the right fielder, Beal, with a good catch, coming on hard, fighting that wind, falling to the ground, but he hung with it. Rodriguez, the pitch, bouncing ball up the middle. And it's a base hit. Steinbeiser with his second hit of the season. Spiders and Hawks meeting for the first time since 2017. 2-2 Two -two pitch. A good breaking ball takes care of Thomas. Slowly towards second, Sprague Lott to Kleska. Around Oel Beery at first in time for the inning ending double play. Double play ground ball to second his first time. And he's caught looking to retire the side. Four strikeouts for Neff and the Hawks. Hipsman two out of eight for the series. Runner at first, nobody out. 
sharply into right field. That's a base hit. Neff on his way to third. It is there easily as the throw goes into second. It's a single for Hipsman. Spider. A towering fly ball into center field. Wall with plenty of room, but this should be deep enough. Wall makes the catch. Here comes Neff with the tag, and Richmond has a 1 0 lead. And he mows Cesarini down to retire the side. First strikeout for Subers. Neff has walked, scored a run, and grounded a third. A wild pitch will tie the ball game. Plesk. No wins or losses. Well, that gets away from Igo. And here comes Beal in to score. The Spiders back in front. Two Spiders in the fifth. High, deep drive to left center. Wall looking up. There it goes. Oh, the wild pitch just cheated Jaffe out of an RBI. He mashes a three-run homer. His third home run of the season, RBIs 20, 21, and 22. Four years at Lafayette, but got that COVID year back. Oh, good breaking ball on the outside corner. And the side's retired. Kleska reached on an error and scored a run his last time. Swings and hammers, one down the left field line. That's extra bases. Into the corner, Conklin had a great jump, and he'll stop at third on the double by Kleska. 3-2. And again, Subers wins the battle. Says. And again, a generous outside corner. Thomas caught looking. I go waves at that one. Subers now with seven strikeouts. 2-2 two, two to Piccolo. And he's down on a breaking ball. Eight strikeouts for Subers. First 8-10 series. Bounced left side. Cut off by Jaffe, the third baseman. And he makes the play. Ball game's over. Spiders win. Right, Johnny grounds out. And the Hawks down in order in the ninth. Richmond wins this one, 7-2.